What's up, Divine Family? Welcome back to my channel. Karmic Circus, where we get rid of and throw all of these karmic ass clowns in the tent. Okay, I expose them for you. I kind of got thrown off since I ain't had my little karmic music clown playing it. Karmic clown music, it got me all like fucked up right now. Divine Family. Okay, um, this reading is about somebody that came in your life as an illusion of love. This person fooled you. They made you believe that they was in love with you. This person seen the creativity in you. This person came off as an illusionist, as being creative, just as creative as you. Everything you did, this person made believe that they was in that same boat. But they was it was just an illusion. They were sent to you by the demonic forces to throw you off your path. So Holy Spirit, I need you to show my divine family what are the energies that's trying to throw them off their path to take them away from their life purpose. This is the energy of a gay for pay. This is a gay for pay energy, okay? This is a prostitution energy in my debt to me, okay? This is somebody who could either sell their body, they go both ways, okay? This is somebody who's bisexual. It's a masculine energy. Um, that's a feminine. A man that's a masculine, and a man that's a feminine energy. This man, he could be gay for pay. He could, you know, have sell, sold his soul. Hold on. I'm sorry, you guys, one second. Um, my dog had a stroke, and she's in there hollering, and it's, it's almost time. It's, hold on. The dog just died. Um, I have a, a Maltese. She had a stroke. Um, I didn't know what was wrong with my dog. I just went in the backyard four days ago. And um, she was in. She had jumped up in a crate, um, and I thought something had attacked her. I thought a coyote came in a crate. 
but she had a stroke and I didn't know. And um, I couldn't afford to take her to the vet. So, I, you know, she she ain't been able to walk. She just, she been trying to survive. And she would, um, I know I'll never find a dog like that. That was the only dog I had that chased the ball. I would take her to the park. She's well, this big, a little Maltese. She's, she would be um, turning 50 this year. I've had her for seven years, eight years, damn near. And it was nothing I can do. Veterinary bills are just as high as hospital bills. They put them to where you can't afford it. Excuse me. Let me let me pause it. I'm sorry for my family. My dog just died. And, um, she's a part of my family. And um, I just want to show you a video to let you see why I'm going to miss her so much. <laughs> I will take my park, my dog to the park with me, and I'll be going to stuff. I could just walk with her, and um, everybody fell in love with her. She just died just five minutes ago. And, um, I was supposed to be doing a reading for you guys, but I can't. I can't right now.